Hey everyone, it's Colin here at eTrailer. Today we have a 2015 Subaru Crosstrek and we've been test fitting some roof racks on it and right now we have the Thule Wing Bar Evo roof rack system installed. Now this is a roof rack that's been designed to mount to your race side rails of your Crosstrek and this is going to allow you to get your favorite rooftop accessories loaded up, whether you want to carry a bike up there, maybe a kayak, or even a cargo box that you can load up with some luggage and some other cargo and can serve on space on the inside of your Crosstrek. Now with this roof rack system, up top we're going to have our 47 inch long wing bar evo crossbars. These are going to be what you mount all your accessories to. You can see that we have them in black right now, but if you think that silver would match your cross track better, you can go ahead and get that kit. Uh, it's also sold here at each trailer, whatever matches your Subaru best. We have a nice aerodynamic shape to both of them that's going to will just be just going to help cut down on that wind noise and drag especially when you compare it to a standard square or round bar roof rack system we also have a t-slot up top that we can use just flip open that cap and we can insert our t-slot accessories between the two strips to our desired location on the crossbar tighten it down and then we'll be good to go now down here we're going to have our evo raised rail feet this is kind of the middleman between the raised side rails and our crossbars it's clamping down onto our side rails, giving a nice hold. You can see that the vehicle is moving a lot. This thing's not budging at all. We've got nice rubber coating around the entire clamping system. This helps make sure it doesn't harm or scratch the finish of your side rails. Go ahead and take that end cap off so you can kind of see what's on the inside. That's the bolt right there. We just tighten it down with our included tool. That's really all there is to it. You just tighten it down, it's all good to go. What's, that's what's something that's nice about this roof rack system and it's that it's a lot easier to install than a standard pad and clamp system for a naked roof and it's easily removable too. We also got some pop locks right here. We can replace those with the one key system from Thule that'll just provide more security for our roof rack. Now we're also gonna have a 220 pound weight capacity for this setup. That's uh, a lot more than a lot of other uh, aero systems out there. So you should be able to get this thing loaded up but do be sure you double check with your Crosstrex owner's manual and make sure your roof can handle that weight. Well, now we've gone over some of those features, we'll go ahead and show you guys how to get this installed. Now install is pretty easy. All we have to do is get our evil raised rail feet installed into the channels right here of our wing bar. So we'll just pop the end cap off and then slide this into that bottom track, just like that. Put the end cap back on. That's all it takes, so we're ready to go ahead and get on our roof. Now we're going to measure our crossbar spread to make sure we get our bars as parallel as we can to each other. Now real quick, I'll point out how I got the front one installed. All I did was I picked a spot on the side rail to measure from, so I just picked that little crease right there, measured to the edge of my raised rail foot on both sides, and then I tightened it down. Now with the crossbar spread, there's really no set measurement. You just want to make sure it's at least 27 and a half inches. Usually I base it off of whatever accessory I might be using that day. So we're going to measure from the front bar to front bar of each. We're at 28 inches. We'll just stick with that. So I'll go over to the other side and make sure that it's 28 inches. Now we can begin tightening down our raised rail feet. What I like to do first is kind of pull down on it and push it up against my race side rail just to get it as flush as possible. And I'll just tighten that up with my finger as far as I can. Just goes a little quicker than using the tool. And I'll grab my included tool and tighten it down. I've already done this for the other side. So we just have to finish up this side and we'll be good to go. Now the tool is gonna let you know when it's fully torqued. You can hear those clicks right there letting you know that it's fully torqued, so we'll just grab our end cap and put it on. And then when you're done installing, it's always a good idea to go ahead and grab a hold of both of your crossbars and give it a good shake. Just go back and forth, up and down. You can see that the entire vehicle is moving. This thing's not going anywhere. Now we're ready to load up our favorite Thule rooftop accessories and then hit the road. Well, thank you all for watching. That'll do it for our test fit of the Thule Wing Bar Evo roof rack system on our 2015 Subaru Crosstrek.